Welcome to Colorado Northwestern Community College. In this tutorial, I want to show you real briefly uh, what tools you will be using to be successful in the virtual classroom. Right now, we are looking at the Colorado Northwestern Community College homepage. For the virtual classroom, a good resource to use is over here under Resources and Departments and Learning Technology. On this learning technology page, you will see two pieces of information. One is called Desire to Learn, which is our learning management system. Crossroads is your one-stop shop for students who want to access their student email, view final grades, or register for classes. Incidentally, you can also use Crossroads to log into our learning management system, Desire to Learn. Let's take a look at what Crossroads looks like. So on this page, I'm going to click on the Crossroads link. Here on the Crossroads link, I will put in my S number and I will put in my password. You should have received a password when you registered for classes or applied to the school. So I'm going to go ahead and put mine in right here. As you can see, we are now in the Crossroads portal. There are a few important things to take a look at on this page. Number one, here's some important dates that will always be up to date over here on the left hand side. Um, you will also see any new announcements that might be coming your way. Um, but most of the work that you're going to do is going to be under the student tab. Here on the student tab, this is where you will access desire to learn. So if I click on that, notice it opens up a new page and now I am in desire to learn. I'm going to go ahead and go back to crossroads, but know that D2L is the learning management system and that you will need to be submitting your homework and getting class details from D2L. To learn more about D2L, watch the D2L tutorial. On Crossroads, this is also where you would register for classes. Notice here's your registration tools. You can even update your address and phone numbers and email addresses. And you can see your class schedule. Over here is your student email and when you click on that, you will be taken to your student email account. And that's about it for Crossroads. Um, in the next tutorial, we will take a look at Desire to Learn and how Desire to Learn works.